friends, you join me at the mall. We're doing something different. I have no idea what I'm gonna call this video, but I'm basically gonna pick out outfits for my boyfriend and we will see if he wears them. We are currently at Century City Mall. We're gonna go into H&M. If you enjoy these types of videos, subscribe, give this one a thumbs up. We've done it before where he's rated my outfits, my thrift store outfits, my Fashion Nova outfits, my wigs. This lipstick is bright. Let's go inside and find him some outfits. He's very picky and he's just very picky. So I'm pretty sure he's not gonna get anything I recommend, but we'll see. Let's go. All right, we're in the men's section. The men's section in this H&M used to be a lot bigger. I have no idea what's going on. I know that he would not wear any of this stuff. So I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> he's more of a button up kind of guy. There he is wearing a button up. <laughs> He always goes for dressy stuff. This place feels like it's kind of lower in the, uh, like more casual stuff going on here. Yeah, and why is it so small? I know they're doing renovation. We're at the H&M in Century City Mall, by the way. They were. I don't know what happened. You think they're done? Yeah. He already has this shirt. He looks really good in pink, as you can see there. Pink. Hey, hot stuff. All right, well, I'm at least gonna pick one outfit for you from here. Just try it on. Very casual stuff. Well, there's nothing wrong with casual. This is something I think he might actually wear. It's a white button-up shirt, although it's long sleeve, which isn't really nice for summertime, but I think it's cute. I have a question. Yes? Question. Are you buying stuff you think I would like or that you would like to see on me? I would like to see both. Oh, this would look nice. We'll keep this as an option. What in the world are these? <laughs> are these for swimming or what? <laughs> you want to try these on? Yeah, that's for going out. Oh my. These are underwear. Yeah, these are underwear. Okay. I highly doubt he would wear this, but I'm gonna give it to him to try on because I think it's cute. He prefers V-neck t-shirts, but we'll see. I don't know how I feel about these, but I want to see him try them on. They're like, oh my god, these people are like following me. They're like, um, I don't know, pattern shorts? I think they're kind of, I don't know. I need to see them. Okay, first up, would you like to turn towards me, please? Sure. They were nice enough to let me come in the fitting room with him. We have... <laughs> turn around! I feel like I'm at my mom and dad's um, honeymoon. First up, we have a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> I really like those shorts, actually. They look nice on you. Yeah, they look good for like swimming pool or something. Summer. <laughs> yeah, I think you should get those. Um, that shirt, I don't know. I do, I don't know. That shirt's wild. Fit number two, white button up, black shorts. I don't he doesn't think these go together. He doesn't think they go together. I don't think this, don't think this is meant to be untucked. Plus you can see through it. What are you guys thinking? I think it looks nice. It looks like that's nice. I like the shorts too. Yeah. That's well. I like the shirt. Yeah, that shirt is nice on you. You should get that. The shirt's nice. I like the shirt. For LA summers in the evening, like if we go this up. Nice. This is nice. Okay, last outfit. He doesn't like it. Doesn't like the shorts. Doesn't like the top. It's cool. I feel like I'm in high school. Like this round neck t-shirt. <laughs> he told you he likes v-neck t-shirts. This one is a no. All right, let's quickly do some product reviews. That was basically a fail. He didn't get anything. That H&M... Um, that mall's going through a lot of construction, the Westfield Century City Mall. If you're in Los Angeles, I'm sure you've heard of it. It's a huge mall. And that H&M used to be really good and really big, but I don't know, since they've been going through construction, I feel like they don't have as many good products as they used to. So he didn't end up buying anything. We actually went to another H&M at the Beverly Center, and that H&M is awesome. It's almost like a separate men's store, essentially. And he ended up buying a lot of stuff from there. So that one was kind of a fail. Product reviews first up I actually have this on now these both are from Clarins this is the Clarins um, sunscreen care oil spray you can use this on your body and your hair I have it on now I really like it it has a very fresh clean scent it soaks into the skin I do recommend putting this on if you're doing makeup you need to put this on like 10 minutes before your makeup because it is very oily and you need to let it soak into the skin um, 
I would actually use the cream on the face and then the the oil on the body. So I really like this. I've never used a sunscreen oil until this one. And then this is their, this is a moisturizer, a sunscreen, and it's great for wrinkle control. So this is a sunscreen for face wrinkle control cream. It says moisturizes, age control, and it's hydration, and it's SPF 50. So I use this one on the face, um, and then I've been using this on the body. I tried using this on the face. I, you can see it in the Makeup in Reverse Challenge, and it's just really oily, so I recommend using that one on the body. Um, next up, Real Techniques. I actually use this in the Makeup in Reverse challenge also. This is the Real Techniques Face Base Set. So it comes with these four brushes, foundation brush, buffing brush, powder brush, and then this little cup, which I actually use a lot to travel. I already owned this, and then Real Techniques sent this one to me for free. Um, I already own this. I bought it like two or three years ago, but I travel with this all the time because I take quite a bit of makeup brushes with me when I travel. So this is really handy because you can just stick them up in there. So <laughs> stick them up in there. So I love that. And you guys know I love Real Techniques brushes. I've been using them for years. They're one of my favorite brushes. I was going to say affordable, but they're one of my <coughs> excuse me favorite brush brands, period. Next up from Yves Saint Laurent Beauty, we have the Rouge Pure Couture um, Lipstick, and this is the shade 17 Rose Dahlia. I actually have it on now, I love this lipstick. It's very pigmented, but it's very smooth, satiny, and moisturizing, I love it. And I love their packaging, I love YSL. I love their Radiant Touch Touche Clots, um, I love their foundation. They're just one of my favorite higher end brands, and I love this lip color, so I've been using that a lot. And lastly, from number seven, we have their City Light Tinted Moisturizer. If you wanna see me apply this, go check out the video, Makeup in Reverse Challenge. Here's the thing, I really like this. It's very moisturizing, it's very lightweight, and it's not my color. I tried to even use it as a, I didn't realize I had this mirror up the whole time. I tried to use it as a concealer, and it's so lightweight that it doesn't really conceal anything. And because it's so light, it's not really my skin tone. Let me show you. I can't really use it as a concealer. This is what it looks like. So I'm gonna have to pass this on to a friend because I know a lot of friends that really like lightweight coverage. And this is medium to dark, I don't know. I think we need like 10 more shades, whoa, darker than this. Um, but I really like the formula. It feels really nice on the skin. It's just, I can't wear it. So I'm gonna pass that on to a friend. That is it for me. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, let me know in the comments down below. I'll try to keep convincing my boyfriend to be in more videos. I hope that you will consider subscribing. Check out some of the videos on the screen. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you soon.